except it's not really that much of a game. I just going back and forth over here. Yeah, it's really easy to download two of the items. So I was like, oh my god. I don't want to download two of the items. And then I figured out how to download like some fuck mans and all and like, all these other mods like Golivers mod or like all those mods. And then now I know how to do it. It's just some mods that are really hard to do. Like Aether Mod is one of them. That kind of just got me a little bit depressed. Wow, well, uh, this isn't going to be good for the YouTube video. It's so dark. Sorry, guys. Um, you know what? This is for you. I'm going to do this for you. I mean, I'm going to put on my cheater. I'm sorry. I mean, I, I want to do this legit, sure, but for you guys, I just, I don't really want to. It just sucks that much. Man, I've been in for so long. Just in the dark, you probably just really want to skip it. But, no, I turned on the cheater for you. Oh, this is uh, okay. So, this is for you guys. Thank you. This isn't for my own good. I'm fine. not cheating. I don't want to cheat, but I just don't want you guys to be watching, like, darkness. Oh, cool, yes. I'm going to turn this cheater off, don't worry. <coughs> I just want to get this cool. Yeah. That ASMR just really got me bummed out, really. I thought I could do it. I thought it just came with it. I was like, oh gosh. And then, yeah, back then I was just like, oh man, that sucks. And my friend was like, Dude, there's this thing called Nether, and I just didn't know that I thought Nether was a mod too, but Nether, the Nether, like, comes with the game. I was like, oh, cool, that's so cool, but I mean, the Nether's not that great. Aether's so much better, it's like flying whales and all that. It's just, Aether's, really. Yeah, yeah it's just what got me, okay. So if you're one of those people like me that haven't played Minecraft yet, I don't really recommend getting it. You never get bored. Unless you've been playing it for like 20 years or something, but really for me I haven't got bored. I've been playing it for like at least one year. I mean, that's not a lie, no, but still I just haven't been, I haven't gotten bored. Maybe just once when I was like really into zombies, when I really got back into zombies, I just stopped playing Minecraft and just started playing Xbox, but you know. Now I just Minecraft, I love it, so I just play, play both, really, but now Minecraft's my big thing. I, I just love it, it's great. I recommend it. Totally. Uh, okay, make friends. So. What was I going to make again? Oh yeah. Definitely. Alright, now I'm just gonna cheat her off. Don't worry. It's totally always gonna cheat forever. I should use some little bit sparingly. Oh, yeah, I'm just I don't really want, I'm gonna block this place off. I don't like having two ways really to my brains. That's just how I roll, you know. Found the claustrophobic in this game really. Okay. okay. Okay, so it's kinda loud. I like the music, so I'm gonna put it on fifty. So I'm gonna put it on thirty. Let's go. When the zombies bang on your door and try to like break your door open. That was so loud. I don't even know why. Okay, here, let me get this iron now. Oh, I need to get iron. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna go for a diamond for a long time because it's really hard. And, uh, it's not really hard, but it just takes a lot of time and effort. A lot of iron pickaxes and a lot of dying lava. Oh, the lava. 
red fruit. Hate that. You just get all your diamonds and you're like, yes, you got my so much diamond. And you just like fall in love and you're like, God, no. Having me so many times. Even without diamonds. Like if you have like all your stuff with you. You're just like walking and you just fall into a big cavern, just fall to your death, just I don't know. Hmm. Oh, that's brings my next thing. I definitely recommend building your house near your spawn because if you die, you don't want to get lost. Like, I've gotten lost way too many times in this game after I died and I couldn't find my house. And if you don't want to build it near your spawn, I recommend that Rigasami's, uh, what's it called? Uh, uh Compass Mod or Mini Map Mod? Yeah, that's it. Rigasami's Mini Map Mod. It's great, easy to download, and. <laughs> Um, it helps you, like, you can, it's, there's a compass, uh, right in the, right here, and, uh, it shows you where you are, and if you could set, like, waypoints and stuff, and then it tells you how to get back to your house, so it's just great, so you can just go exploring so far from your house, and you can just go back there. Okay, so, I don't want to go down. Oh gravel, I'm going over there. Hit gravel, just keeps on falling down. We saw your pickaxe too. I might make another portal though, cause um. I just like going in there and getting a lot of another stuff like glowstone. Just like take out my house. Or like make potions. Oh the blazes. Oh man, it's so hard to I mean it's not hard killing them, but it kind of is like because they shoot fireballs and you can catch them fire, there's no water, jump in just lava, that just kills you. Yeah, you just like fall off the mountain and fall in lava. It's like it's impossible. But it's like if you don't go for the blaze palace or whatever it's called. The nether, or whatever it's the nether palace, or I forgot what they're called, where the blazes live. If you don't go in there, it's like it's a total death trap with a maze. So you like really should make at least three portals: one for your house, one one for your Minecraft world. One for the nether and another one for the nether, just in case so you can build another one of the nether so you can teleport out. <laughs> mm. Okay, so I'm not finding anything. I only have like six iron, so. Cool. Cool's like the most like needed ore, because I mean to get iron ore, I mean to get iron ingots you need Iron ore, yes, but you need coal to smelt it, so it's basically what is the most like thing you actually need? Like you can't survive without wood. Um well you can, like you can get only food and No, actually no, you can't survive without wood. I mean, if you really go hardcore and just eat raw meat and stuff, you can survive without wood, but if you really want to like survive you need wood, that's the most useful thing, but coal, it's the most useful ore, that's what I was getting at. So, I couldn't really survive without coal, because you can't, like, eat raw meat, otherwise get salmon oil. I'm going to use this wooden pickaxe, because I'm going to use the stone pickaxe to get my iron ore and stuff. Torch it down now. <laughs> okay. What else should I talk about? I don't know.
go back up. Let's see what time it is. Let's smoke my iron. Oops, no cheater. And if you wanted to know what the cheater was, it's another mod. It's a great mod for servers and for a single player if you want to cheat. Just be like that, but it's great. Um, it's called Zombs Mod, Zomb Zombs mod Pack, like Z O M B E. Zombs Mod Pack. And uh, it's just great. It's it's fairly easy to download. Like, go on Minecraft DL and it actually tells you how to download it with words at the bottom of the page. It's just a great mod. It has a bunch of mods together. It's it's fairly easy to activate the mods. It just takes a lot of like knowing how to do it and scale kind of to activate the mods. <laughs> but once you have them activated, there's a certain multiplayer mods and single player mods. So if you have you could have like fly on multiplayer servers and, and like X-ray only if it's like allowed. I mean not allowed but like enabled. It's not that they want you to do it, but it's like enabled and not disabled. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's not disabled. Like, some servers, which I really don't like, because I like on servers that I don't play, like, I don't legitly play on, like, OS gaming. Um, I like to use fly and stuff. Just to like, get around, look around, just like fool with people and stuff. Uh, so, that's what it like works. Here, I'll show it to you. And you fly, it's just. There's a speed up thing, there's x ray, uh, there's the ore mod, and it shows you what ores are. It's just great for uh, cheating on multiplayer survival servers that you don't usually play on, fooling around with them. Um, but you see, that's just watch yourself and stuff. And there's also single player mods that you can activate, like uh, Death Chest or uh, Sun, or you could like put the Sun wherever you want, like daytime, nighttime, something, but you could also do that with too many items also, <laughs> and you could also do like retrace your steps, like you could have whenever you walk, there's like red lines behind you, it just, it also creates a lot of lag, because you're like, tr whenever you walk, and you're walking a lot of, you're walking a lot in Minecraft, so it's kind of like, um, creates a lot of red things and it's just also so mumbo jumbo like you can walk in the circles like I do a lot in the mines I just walk back and forth it's just like really unnecessary like I just did right there so like you can't really follow your steps that's why the it's, uh, the compass mod is better for me you know? <laughs> um so yeah I should make a mine somewhere like, I don't want to mine in my house with them. <laughs> so I'm just going to block out <sighs> all those torches. All that work. Let me get that torch. I'm going to make a whole bunch of... Oh, I already have torches. I'm going to just make... Toast my own um, smoke it. Let me go make a mine shaft now. I'll make it over here. <laughs> Not too far away. Right over here. Across. No, I'm gonna make all my hair this. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Gotta be kidding me. It's just uh oh, gosh, I did it really um spirit of making a mine right now. Actually this could be my mine shaft and I just make a second story. That's what I'm gonna do. But this is just like a sap. This is just like a 